Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Jana's on Tour. It's been three weeks, but we are back and ready to go. Today is FA Cup Round 2 on the 1st of December 2018. I have my Christmas jumper on, ready to go. So today, Plymouth Argyle host Oxford United in a rematch of the league game a couple of months ago where we lost 2 0. Now, recent results have been very up and down again. Uh, I didn't go last Saturday, but we beat Fleetwood 2-1. Uh, a very good performance that Rich can talk about in a minute. Things were looking up, and then we go and put in a really shocking performance at Shrewsbury on Tuesday. So today, in my eyes, is a game that would be good to win because it's money and it's positivity, and it could set up a really good third-round draw. So today, although it's not a league game, I think we need to win it to get confidence back and get some of those players... Uh, playing some good football, hopefully. So, looking at the opposition, Jamie Mackey and Curtis Nelson will be returning to home park. They obviously both scored against us in the uh, away game in the league a few months ago, so they're going to be a threat. But I'm going to be positive today, and I'm going to go for a 2-1 Argyle win, get us through to the third round and set up a big game in the third round, hopefully, and then obviously on to next week's massive game against Bradford. So we're in the car at Mum's, just about to go to the ground. We are with Rich, the regular Rich. I am. And then Rich, all right? Rich, you went last week to the game. What did you think of it? It was more positive than the week before. Yeah? But they, there were some good saves by their goalkeeper. Yeah. yeah? It's sort of been 4-5 out I don't know how well we dominated the mat. And Ladapo uh, scored a couple of goals as well. Uh, he never got into it until the last 20 minute. But, but luckily he obviously... In managers, sort of stuff out yeah. there. So things were looking up, and then Tuesday night happened. We don't play well away one room. I think that yeah. turned into a major issue next this season. Yeah, it is. It's consistency, isn't it? There's yeah. a lack of it. So what do you think about today's game, Rich? What? How do you see it going? Uh, I see it being very tough. Yeah? My chat telling me i like to see I win it 1-0, but I've got a feeling we may be on the one end. You think we might be? Yeah. Yeah, I think it would be tough. Oxford have come into a good form recently, so... And we've got a bow back to our own work. At Oxford, I don't remember the last time we beat them at all. Yeah, I've never seen us beat Oxford to be fair, so uh, we'll be tough. Okay, uh, do you think the game's important, Rich? What, what are you bothered about today or not? Yeah, I'm bothered because I like to see a nice team down here at least to Dara Adams and many to work with at least. Yeah, true. Okay, well, uh, we will see you at Home Park. Uh, all the uh, reaction before the game, hopefully catch up with a few people, and then obviously we will try and get as many highlights as we can, and hopefully another goal you can see us celebrating like <laughs> last time. Yeah, that too. Yeah. So, see you at um, Home Park in a bit. Green Army! Hello guys, back again. We are on the nice wintry walk up to Home Park. Lovely winter's day. We are now with Sean Beebs Fallick. Here he is. Sure, what's your thoughts on today's game and prediction? Get a result. A result? What? A, a win to get us through or a replay? Yeah. A win. Okay, what's your score prediction then? 2 1. 2 1? Fantastic. Hopefully, we can quite like when, when to get another game when we win. Yeah, to a, bit, a big draw, yeah. yeah. Well, we're about to get run over by a truck. Okay, well, good stuff. All of us are going for wins today. We don't want a replay, we don't want an extra game. Come on, you greens. Lots of players have arrived. Okay, welcome back everybody. We are with the pessimist himself, Mr. Drews, Alex. Okay, what are your thoughts on today's game? Right, I think it'll be a 1-1 draw. Uh, we'll get a replay back over Oxford and I think we'll go out. Hope I'm wrong as always, but I just this inconsistency is driving me mad at the moment. Yeah. One week we get a win, next week we don't turn up with the same personnel. Um, yeah, I, we might be able to squeeze it maybe, but I think it's going to be a draw. So. Okay, well, let's hope you're wrong. Yeah, okay, hope. and we have Jamie with us as well, special guest. Yeah. What do you think? I'm going to be the same as Juicy. Oh. I think it's 1 1. I'd like a 1 0, but like secretly I think it's our 4 1 4. I think it's going to be 2 1 off. Okay, right, okay, well, fine. Well, I'm still. I'm going for 2 1. So. 2 1 as well. So. Let's hope we can get through, get a big That's team. A, yeah. yeah. Get some much needed money in the coffers. Yeah. That won't be spent by the board. Exactly. <laughs> right. Thank you very much, guys. See you later on. Go on, you 
like we're out of the FA Cup this year.
Too risky, Brad. Inside. Oh, God, Brad. Ah. Ooh. Ah. Oh. 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 I don't understand people leaving when we've got a corner <laughs> to go to 2 2. Yeah. Oh! oh corner! Oh! oh. Holy sh Hello, guys, we're back in the car, just dropping Rich off. Plymouth Argar 1, Oxford United 2. Started the half, second half really poorly, conceded two pretty bad goals. We gave it a good go at the end, uh, got a goal with Sarsevich, and then at the end, we, you know, Lamiros could have scored, Fox could have scored, had a couple cleared off the line. Just wasn't our day. The ref was a conference referee, uh, he bottled it at times, didn't give enough cards, so disappointing to be out of the FA Cup. Um, but now on to a massive, massive game against Bradford in the league on Saturday. If we lose that, the pressure is back on and things are not looking good going into 2019 and staying in League One this season. So disappointing, but we go on to next week, which is a game we must win. I'll take winning next week over today. So Rich, what do you think very quickly? Uh, disappointed is the second half, we just never turn up. No, and uh, Oxford came at us, didn't they, with good pace? A lot of pace. Yeah, so... As I said, next Saturday, massive Bradford. Massive, yeah. If we lose to Bradford, I don't think Terry Adams would be around. No. If we if, if we win it, though, we close the gap. Yeah, I hope so. But other team around us may be winning as well. Yeah. So the so gap may too be at the Just same. need to do our best. Okay, well, thank you guys for watching. A little bit of a disappointing result. Uh, but, like I said, next Saturday, I will be there. Rich will be there. Oh, yeah. We'll be cheering on the greens and we'll be vlogging it for you. So, see you next week for Plymouth Argyle versus Bradford in a must win game. Come on, you greens. Cheerio. See you later.